Dear friends, today we are going to discuss the various aspects of autonomic nervous system. Autonomic nervous system is the part of peripheral nervous system which supplies the internal organs, especially the smooth muscles and the glands. It largely works unconsciously. The main integrator of autonomic nervous system in brain is hypothalamus. Hypothalamus receives the regulatory inputs mainly from the limbic system. Now we'll discuss the divisions of nervous system. The nervous system can be divided into central nervous system and the peripheral nervous system. Central nervous system includes brain and a spinal cord. While the peripheral nervous system is again divided into two components that is somatic nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. The somatic nervous system includes cranial nerves and the spinal nerves. In human cranial nerves are 12 pairs while the spinal nerves, while the spinal nerves are 31 pairs in human. The autonomic nervous system is having three components. Sympathetic nervous system, parasympathetic nervous system and the enteric nervous system. Enteric nervous system is considered as second brain. It largely works independently. So it is also a point of discussion in autonomic nervous system. Although SNS and PSNS may influence the enteric nervous system, but how it will work that will be discussed in the later lectures.